Hi, my name is Fawn Moore. I'm the Regional Program Manager for DCF in the Central Region of Florida. And we wanted to take this opportunity to explain to you the value of comfort calls across the state and across the nation. We are venturing into this new, exciting, uh, successful um, opportunity for our staff to really build a foundation for our current caregivers and our biological parents of children that go into a removal episode. During the removal episode, there are many emotions that are heightened in a family. Uh, children are nervous, parents are nervous, parents are scared, children are scared. It's not clear where they're going to end up and comfort calls really build the foundation and lay that trust and relationship for not only the child to see and observe, but for the biological family to witness and for the current foster parent or the caregiver to be exposed to. This opportunity to have comfort calls in our jurisdiction is really giving us the opportunity to do something very simple that lays a long-standing foundation for our children and families. Please, we're urging you to take this opportunity to really change the lives of our children that come into foster care and to a substitute care in our circuit. We really understand that families have a lot of emotions during this time, and this is one opportunity and one area that our CPIs and our case managers can really make a difference in building that trust between families. Okay, Jennifer. So the next step is I'm going to take them to the caregivers. Okay. When I arrive to the caregiver home, I will give you a phone call let you know that we arrived there safely. Okay. I would then give the phone to the caregiver so y'all can speak with each other and you can let them know all information about the children that you have for them in regards to their likes and dislikes of things. Okay, thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Hello? Hello, Miss Jennifer? Yes, ma'am. Hi, it's Miss Jones calling from the Department of Children and Family Services. Hi. I'm calling to let you know that I have arrived with the children. We made it here safely, and I'm going to let you speak with the caregiver now, okay? Okay, thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Hold on, please. Yes, ma'am. Hi, it's Darlene. How are you? I'm fine. How are you doing? It's nice to kind of meet you. We want to let you know that the kids are here, and um, we're going to just take really good care of them for you and okay. to you get them back home. And uh, we're here for the kids, but we're also here for you. We want to be a support system for you as well. So, thank you. Um, is there anything that you'd like to share that we should know about the kids or any questions you want to ask? Yes, ma'am. I'd like to let you know that Sean loves his video games <laughs> and he loves reading. Mm -hmm. And Star is allergic to penicillin, and her likes are making slime and getting dressed up oh. being pretty. <laughs> awesome. Okay. Well, I really am excited to meet you as well. Like I said, we really want to support you and work with you. We're just here to cheer you on. So I think you have a visit this week. Um, would it be okay if we come to the visit and meet you in person? Yes, ma'am. That's fine. Oh, good. Okay. Well, I, I look forward to meeting you. Okay, so it was nice talking to you, and do you want to talk to the kids real quick? Okay, hold on, I'm going to put you on speaker, okay? Alright, here's Mommy. Hey, babies. Hey, hey Mom. Mommy. Listen, you guys are going to stay with the foster parents for a little while. She seems like she's a really nice woman, and she's going to take good care of y'all. Okay? Okay. Yes, and then we're going to get a visit together so I can meet her and I can see you guys, okay? Yes, ma'am. Okay. I love y'all very much, and I'm going to be working very hard and getting us back as a family. Y'all just hang in there, and I love y'all. Love y'all, too. Okay, bye, babies. 
Hi, my name is Jennifer, and this situation happened to me and my children, and I want you to know that if it wasn't for the love and support from this foster family that had my children, I may have never been reunified back with my children. Hi, I'm Susan Ripley with Heartland for Children. We feel the importance of a comfort call can make all the difference with a birth parent when their children have to be removed. By taking away the fear that they experience of where their children are going and connecting them with a caregiver, we believe it can directly affect the permanency outcomes for our children in care.